Hey everybody, Part and Joe here. Welcome back for part 37 of Let's Play Paper Mario. In the last part, we actually uh, upgraded a lot of our party members. We have every party member upgraded but Goombario and uh, Koopa. Or Cooper, rather. Um, now, remember how I said we were actually going to open up the next chapter in this video? I kind of uh, forgot that there was actually an optional boss. Uh, mini boss. Uh, no, an actual boss. Uh, mini. Uh, think. Okay. An optional boss. There we go. Was that so hard to say? We have an optional boss, which is right over here. I forgot to actually uh, mention that. But let's fix up our badges a little bit, because we actually have not fixed this up since uh, the last place. So, don't want that anymore. Um... Let's see... Let's put put power jump on and um, I spy. <clears throat> so let's uh go over here and we got this guy. Hey, you in the hat? Wait, it's fine weather, isn't it? My name is Can't See Koopa. Please remember it, okay? If you want to use this road, you need to pay me a hundred coins. So sorry, but this is how it is to pay. So you have to pay me. And we have a hundred coins on the dot, but we're actually not. We're gonna fight him. And don't pay your fight. We're gonna fight you. Now we have an optional boss here. Uh, he has 70 health, which is quite a lot um, for this. But what did you actually do is click Lullaby. And uh, he looks threatening and everything because he takes away a ton of health when he attacks. He takes away like six or seven like that. But we can actually put him to sleep like this for four turns. And um, actually cause him damage like this. So. Get him on his back. Like that. And you can just keep doing this. Just spam this attack over and over again. Just keep him like this. And just keep attacking him. Oh, wow. He only does two. His defense is pretty high. So. No, it's not high, but. You know what I mean. Wow, I did nothing. Um. She's Bo, because I think she would take away the most at this point. There we go. So with Bo's new attack, this is why I wanted her upgraded. It takes away a, ton, a couple, a lot of FP, but it's worth it. Look at this. Oh, if it would help if you actually hit him. Kind of missed him there. Let's do lullaby again. Yeah, you're gonna have to hit his tail. I forgot to mention that. His tail is the weak spot, not his uh, outer shell. So as long as you hit the tail, you're good. Let's try this again. Jeez, yeah, you're gonna hit his tail. And look at this. Two, 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 two. It's her it's her like attack that does two each time, so it's like double. Which really can be really helpful. Use it again. So yeah, look at him. He's already like more than halfway done. So Ah, oh, still only four. It's doing like 16 damage each turn, which is ridiculous. But okay, the 13 now. Three health left. See, he's really not a tough fight at all. It's actually really easy if you do this cheap way. But if you don't use the uh, Star Spirits, he is a tough fight. He's a really tough fight if you don't use the Star Spirits. Oh, wow, we got another level up. Awesome. Seems like just recently we got a level up, like two videos ago. Uh, let's go BP, since we actually do I do use a lot of badge points. Okay. Now that's over. Let's head this way. Let's actually look at... Uh, Badge shop, badge shop before we uh, on to our next chapter here. Ooh, what's this? Group focus. Let's Mario party members use the focus command as well. <sighs> Could be useful, but no. And eh, nothing good. 
Um, alright, so let's, oh, whoa, 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 go back, go back. Let's actually open up our next chapter, are you ready? Here we go. Bulbs come from a flower field land called Flower Fields. They say the flowers in flower fields are in trouble. To get the flower fields, you need four kinds of seeds that only bulbs possess. But where are the bulbs? Please, Mario, you must look for the bulbs and get the seeds from them. Maybe Marlin's fortune telling could help you. Yeah, we actually kind of got them, so let's give her the things. This is why it's very important to get these. If you don't know where they are, you can always look back at my videos. Uh, I think chapter 2, 2, 3, uh, 5, and um, this to in Toe Town actually all have the bulb bulbs. So just look in those chapters, or you can go back to the videos and look for it as well. Um, so yeah. So just one more. And look at that. Now that they're all back, we can open up a magical door. <clears throat> okay. So now we actually can head down into it, and that will open up, up to... Chapter 6! Dark Days in Flower Fields. Yes! And here we are, guys. A brand new chapter. Well, ho! Now, who might you be? Ho, ho. Up here, son. They call me Wise Wisdom. Wise Wisterwood. I am the oldest tree here in the flower fields. A land of trees, flowers, and grasses, and plants. And I also look like the great techie tree from Ocarina of Time. Are you- Oh, and you must be- Mario! I've heard a lot about you, son. You're trying your best to save the star spirits and the rest of the world, aren't you? Very noble. If that's what it is true, then, uh, you've arrived means a star spirit is here in our land. I would help you in your quest, but alas, I cannot right now. Flowerfield is in trouble. A creature named Huff and Puff and his followers invaded our fair land not too long ago. These creatures brought clouds to our sunny skies. It has been dark and cloudy ever since. The sun doesn't even bother to uh, rise in the sky anymore. We are all weak and fading. Oh! I remember something! The rumor is that Huff and Puff is holding somebody captive. Of course, it must be a star spirit that you seek searching for. Oh ho! You're going to defeat the wicked Huff and Puff, eh? Well, that would make the wishes of flower fields come true, but it's not that easy. Huff and Puff is up in the sky on what we call a cloudy climb. There's no way up there now. Well, you might be able to reach it if you find a magical bean or something that grows high. Now, wait a minute. I think there is a flower that has a magical bean somewhere. Um, I believe her name is Petunia. Perhaps she is off in the, to the east. It wouldn't hurt to go visit her and ask about it. Yeah, the flowers and bulbs are around here. Might have some useful information as well, I'd say. Talk to everyone. Alright, you could do that, or you can not if you know what you're doing. But guys, this looks like a good place to end it off here. So next time on Let's Play Paper Mario, we're actually going to be tackling down Chapter 6. So see you then.